Hi guys, welcome back to Farming Simulator 22. We are going to be making a map review. We are going to be taking a look at the in-game map, which is Elm Creek. And here in Elm Creek, we have a uh, spring, summer, autumn. I think we have autumn at the current moment. We have autumn. In the month of September and it is snowing here. We are gonna take a look at the map. I want to buy I want to buy a vehicle. I want to buy the Mahindra here. Mahindra, I wanna buy that one here. Okay. Um, I wonder where the dealership is. Dealership. Let's have a look where the dealership is on the map. Because I haven't spotted it at all. Um, dealership. Where is the dealership? We need, we need to jump out. Ah, here is the dealership. That is the dealership right there. We are going to drive around the map, around the Elm Creek map, and we're gonna have a look at it. So we're gonna hitch is the helper menu. Um, the helper menu that didn't do anything. We can uh, use the, the belts here if we have a load on the back. The helper. Mm. No, that's uh, that's not uh, doing anything at the current moment. So we are gonna see and have a look what the map looks like. This is the dealership here. Clever Motors is the dealership here. Yeah, just uh, checking the steering here for my wheel setup. Yeah, that is working. And we have to just stop and go as well. Brilliant. Alright. Anyway, this is the dealership where, where you can buy and and sell your vehicles as well. We're gonna see if we can uh, go in. No, we can't go in. We can uh, call up our dealership up here like that and we can uh, buy our vehicles that we need. And I think over there you can uh, sell them. Look at this, guys. Nice, a nice wintry type of scene here. Yeah, here you can uh, practically have your vehicles fixed. You uh, go in here, you put your vehicle here. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna place my vehicle there and I'm gonna show you guys what I mean. All right, we're here. We're gonna be pressing the R key, and uh, here we can see if we need to fix the vehicle or if we want to paint it or if we want to configure it. We can uh, configure it the Mahindra, but we can't configure it the Mahindra at the present moment because we don't have any configuration blocks so that is what we can do that way we can configure it to vehicles so 
so we are staying here on the um, let's see what's back here yeah look at the look at those uh, tires they're digging right into the snow here that is brilliant probably part of the dealership here Oh, that is awesome. Look at that, guys. <laughs> that is the sign up. Yeah, that is, um, look at that. That is pretty awesome. We're here on, on a wintry, a wintry scene on the Elm Creek map. Look at that, guys. <laughs> awesome. And, and, and look how, how the snow is, uh, covering the trees here, guys. That looks pretty sick. Look at that. Wow. That is awesome. Wow. Look at the sign here. What does it say? Uh, Frizzy, Frizzy Spitz Extreme. All the, the Spitz Twist. The Frizz. <laughs> Is that the, the oil mill here? Natural oils. Yeah, the traffic seems to be going through here at a quicker rate than I had expected. Uh, open up the map here. We are, I think we are, where are we? Um, we left the shop. We left the store. Ooh, the store is here. So we should be... Um, where are we? We are right at the roundabout somewhere. I think we we are here. Here we are. We can uh, I can see that that little arrow here. That is where we are, and we have a couple of cell points there as well. We're gonna have him sit right here. We're gonna jump over. So we're gonna have a look what the oil mill here is all about. We're gonna visit the oil mill because I, I want to see where the trigger is here for the oil mill that is the oil mill here that means we can uh, sell our canola here now i don't know why they have here what is that all about okay that is the production chain means we can uh, buy it here for eighty thousand, which i'm not going to buy right now we can buy this um, oil mill here. And here we can... Uh, I just want to check something here real quick. Here it is. Um, the oil mill. Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a different setup here. Mm, <laughs> what can we sell at the oil? oil mill here, canola. Yeah, we can sell a canola here at the oil mill. All right. We can sell canola and I think we can uh, sell the canola oil as well. Natural oils. All right. Swoop to the back here. We can run. Nice here. That is our first uh, I think our first cell point here by far. All right, first cell point. But we have to. I think we have to buy this first for eighty thousand. All right. Um, the mini map. Uh, yeah, I need the mini map up. So let's have a look what this is. Um, that is looks like as if it is the stone crusher. Yeah, that is the stone crusher here. I know this, 
little machine here from F uh, 17 and have a 17 that little machine here that uh, dried straw that, that was a, a straw dryer or even a, a, a potato dryer here and now it's um, a stone wrecker you can uh, pick up the stones from your cultivated field and uh, you can use it to crush stone so it's a stone crusher or stone wrecker doesn't matter what you say it's, it's um, it's, it's a stone crusher. Do you think you can uh, get on top here in any way or form? Yes, you can. You can uh, pour the stones in here, I think, and they will they will crush it for you. It says here, support your local farmers, drop off self storage, and I think here you can uh, sell the stones. But I'm I'm going to find that. Out how that will work and you can see here the snow on the ground here which is pretty awesome here it's filling up here all right so the next one here we're gonna stay in that corner is the the, the grape uh, production plant here let's visit that one that is the grape production plant and I think what you do is you come up here to this trigger here, pour in your grapes here. There's the, the grape uh, texture here already shown that you can pour the grape in here. And they will make the grape juice. The grape juice for you. And I think the grape juice is going to come out here. But I don't know, I'm just sweet and sour raisins. Okay. Sweet and sour raisins. Uh, yeah, production chain here. You can open that up with the New Yorkie. We don't have a production chain as of yet because, like I said, I'm just uh, making the Elm Creek review. Alright. So that is our grape juice production plant right here. So let's see what they have here. No, those are just uh, decoration buildings. All right, that is our, or that one here is the grape juice production plant. Here we have the lime station. Mm. Lime station, why can't we visit that one? I want to visit the lime station where station so we are going to have to switch back to our Mahindra the Mahindra here lime station is over there are I mean we can uh, uh, don't need to go in in there at all I'm gonna go up to the map here we can jump out of our Mahindra and just walk over there um, That was, what is this, can we, yeah, we can visit that, we can, uh, we can rent, um, rent a train, hey, ah, okay, you can, uh, rent, rent a train here for a thousand euro per hour, so that means when you're renting a train for a thousand euro per hour, you can use that train to sell your grain. I think that is what it's there for. So, so you rent out a train for a thousand bucks an hour, and uh, if you do that, you can use the train to be able to sell your your grain or what have you. Yeah, I think those are. This is where you. Um, that is a sell trigger. I think and you can uh, sell your grain here all right that is looks like as if it is some type of a cell point here this is the Goldcrest Valley we can't visit that one either way not um, um, yeah 
Goldcrest Valley. What is this here? Oh, okay, this, this is um, a grain storage facility here. I thought it, I thought it was um, some type of a, a cell point, but it's not. It's a grain storage facility, so you can uh, rent out the train, just and uh, you can uh, store your your grain in here, which means uh, you can use the train to collect your your grain here, and you can store it in there, and and up here. I think you can uh, unload your grain as well. Or can you do that here? I think you can uh, unload it here and and load it here. Yeah, that uh, tells me you can uh, load it here and unload it up there. So that is a grain storage facility and not, not a cell point like I have men mentioned here before. Yeah, that is a grain storage facility. Um, east? Grain storage east? Okay, this one here. The Frizzy Spiz. This is a uh, grain storage facility. Loading zone, yeah. You can uh, unload your grain here and uh, that pipe up there, you can uh, load your trailer up with the grain that you have stored here. So that is another grain storage facility as well. What is this here? What is this? This is the lime station, which I'm going over. I want to visit that lime station. Um, yeah, that's where I need to go or want to go. So we're going to have to cross the road here. There's the lime station. Yeah, that is the lime station here. You can uh, collect your lime here. I like how they did that. Collect your lime here, and you can uh, spread your lime onto your field here. Look at that! Look at all the all the snow here on the field, and uh, and how the how the snow here is uh, covering the grain up. That is pretty awesome. Look at that! <laughs> wow. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out. Uh, I'm gonna have to get off the game here and uh, turn the log on because uh, you can fly as well. So, your support, local farmers. Alright, what is this up here? That is the oil mill. I think we've visited that. This is the biogas plant, the, the one MW. See what that, that looks like? Yeah, that is the biogas plant here. Over here, you have probably that is probably a light. Or something and here you pour in your your silage and here yeah you're gonna you're gonna have to buy that first for that amount of money so that is almost <laughs> the total is what you own you only have 1.5 million and you can't you can't buy that when you only have 1.5 million on your on your game account here otherwise you're going to be out of money and you can't start anything with the biogas plant so that is the biogas plant here we have a container where you pour in your silage here and here so your slush your silage here it's going to be going to be turned into slurry in the slurry i think and you can make money off of the, the biogas plant and i think here you can collect the, the slurry here you need a slurry tanker and a tractor trailer a tractor a slurry tanker to be able to collect the slurry here that is the trigger for it and you can use the slurry 
uh, to use it as fertilizer for your field here. And this is this here is the weighing skills. The current moment is uh, zero because we don't have any vehicles on it. I mean, we can uh, put the Mahindra on it, and I think it will weigh the Mahindra because the Mahindra weighs a little bit something. But uh, yeah, this is the biogas plant. And here, you can uh, unload something here as well. Question is, if you, if you can unload something or if you can pull the slurry out of that one here as well. That is the big question. That's just for decoration here. Big hall, looks pretty, pretty awesome. A nice huge hall, and that is the biogas plant. Um, yeah, those are the fruit types here. Fruit one, fruit two. We have grass and oil seed radish. Then we can go in here into to see how our fields are doing, if they are ripe or something. Yeah, this is um, harvest. If the, those, that means that the field is ready to harvest. Orange is if the grain is ripe enough to harvest, the green is still the growing stage here. The blue here is cultivated and there are stubbles stubbles on the farm on the field i should say there's stubbles on the field that means the field has to be cultivated red here means that um, shrubs and weeds have, have to be taken off the field you can either do that with the cultivator or you can uh, spread uh, anhydrous purple means that the field have been harvested off then we have here the, the ground, all that has to be ploughed. Those are all fields that need to be ploughed because in the red here, the red color tells me the fields have to be ploughed. And what is that? Okay, that is awesome. Hotspots. Okay, these are these are hotspots on the side here. So um, with the with the icon vehicle on here. We have the icon here with the tractor. Um, let's see. Let's uh, find out here. Uh, that will probably tell me what type of vehicles I have on the map currently. Harvesters. Here you can uh, see how many harvesters I have on the map. How many trailers here? How many? How much equipment here? Those are docking stations here. You can see it right there. Turn off the docking stations, turn them on, turn them off, turn them back on. Loading stations. Those are all loading stations here. You can see the train under here. Here we have the productions. Those are production facilities here. That one, that one here. That is a production facility. That one here everywhere where there's an arrow pointing to the to the right hand side that one here um yeah that those are all productions like i said those guys here those are loading stations loading docks i should say and these guys here those ones here those are unloading docks where you can unload stuff animals we don't have placed yet. Helpers, we don't have placed. I don't see a, a helper here anywhere. We can do missions. I can't see a single mission here on the map momentarily. And we have here different types of other stuff like we have here the shop, train station here. Here the stain this train station you can uh, rent a train here everywhere where there are train st stations you can here you can rent that one out here 
you can rent this train out, and so on. For great transportation, those are your, those are practically your hotspots. All right. Um, we are gonna continue on up here. The Red Marble Bowling Restaurant. So let's see what that looks like. That is a cell point here. Support your local farmers. It's a cell point where you can uh, sell your goods and your grain. Also, look at that. That's what it's called. The Red Bowling Restaurant. Alright. Nice wintry scene here. Brilliant. Alright, back to the map here. We're going to see what's up here. That is the Green Mill. Let's visit that one here. There's your trigger here, I think, for selling your grain. But, um,. I have the fear that you're gonna have to buy it. Yeah, you're gonna have to have to buy this uh, grain mill here before you can uh, unload all your grain. Yeah, I don't know if, if you can load the grain here or just unload. I don't know if that is a cell point. I think it is a cell point because yeah, here you can. Uh, I think you can uh, either sell your grain or store it, but I'm thinking it is um, a cell point of some sort. Because I don't think you can uh, drive underneath here. I don't know. Maybe you, you, you can. And you can. Uh, maybe this is just some sort of a storage area. Where am I on the map? I'm up here. Um, I'm going to go to, go to hotspots here, real quick. Hotspots. Um, Hotspots. Yeah, that that is a that is a, a production point. That is a production point up here. This guy here was a production point. The biogas plant. Biogas plant. That was the oil mill, that is a production plant that you have to buy. You're going to have to buy all the production plants that are on the map here. We have another production plant down here, which was the grape juice production. You're going to have to buy that. Yeah. That is the icon there. Um... That is another production here, that is the furniture plant here, where you make the furniture, it says here timber time, woodwork, so you, I think you're going to have to buy that one as well, so find out. Yeah, we're going to have to buy that, and that will cost me 60,000. Now all those production points here, they are not cheap. What, what does that do? Uh, Holds for coffin, that means you can sell the wood here. And here is your loading station. Yeah, yeah all those uh, production plants, you have to buy them first. Um, up here we have the muesli plant. That is the muesli plant, you have to buy that one as well. Uh, yeah, 110,000. I think here you put in your your income here and your outcome. Yeah, we're going to have to figure all that out once we are going to be starting a let's play. And that is where I'm going to start, guys. I'm going to I'm going to start here maybe on the Elm Creek, either on either on the Elm Creek, or I'm going to start on the Babylon map. I'm not sure, I haven't decided yet where I'm going to start. So that was, where am I, what did we have a look at there? That was here, the muesli. Let's have a look at the, the milkery. 
Here is the dairy plant here, the, the fair dairy. Yeah, you're gonna have to boil all these because these are all production plants here. Okay. Um. Why can't we buy? Yeah, we can. For some reason, maybe this is different. I'm just gonna run around here. See if, if we have to. What's this guy doing here? Doing here in the snow. <laughs> All right. I think he's a he's a lost cause. Yeah, I don't think we have to. We have to buy. Um, we don't have to buy the, uh, the dairy, the dairy plant. We just kind of make the cheese here. But yeah, like I said, we'll have to try all that out once we start a gameplay or a let's play, I should say. Um, we are up here. The muesli. What is that? That is the. Where we can buy our animals. Our animal dealership. We go in here. We can't buy anything yet because we don't have any uh, pig stories. Uh, sheep pasture, cow pasture. <laughs> that is that is funny. We don't have any of that set up as of yet. So we can't buy any animals. But we can. We know that we can buy them here. But we can't buy anything yet because we don't have any animals set up. This is uh, Larson's Loyal Livestock. Alright. Uh, here we have the sawmill. Sawmill here. Um, we're going to have to buy the sawmill. So let's see how much the sawmill is going to cost me. 100,000. Yeah, so it will cost me a hundred thousand. And I think um, it's here where you put the logs. That is the income, and that here is the outcome. Outcome means probably where the boards are going to be. So you have to go into your forestry area, uh, cut down trees, bring the trees over here, your logs, and they are going to produce wooden boards out of your logs. And over here you get uh, wood chips. These are the wood chips here. <coughs> so every time they are going to produce boards from your logs, you're going to have to, having to end up having wood chips here. And you, and you can sell the wood chips too, you know. I think, I think you can uh, sell wood chips. Um, where was it? Do we have anything for wood chips? Wood chips. <coughs> mm. Yeah, here. You can sell wood chips at the Goldcrest Valley, the Johnson's Farmer Market, or at the South Valley Biomass Energy. All right. Back up to the map here. What is this here? The Johnson's Farmer Market. So let's visit that one. Johnson's Farmer Market here. That is practically a cell point. I wonder if you can uh, close the hatch here. No, don't think you can. Uh, no, you can't close the hatch. And you can see the snowflakes that are coming down here. Those look like in real life snowflakes real life snowflakes brilliant all right awesome so this is a cell point mm. yeah what do we have here this is the spinnery let's go to the spinnery here yeah spinnery if you have sheep and a sheep pasture and they will produce the wool you can bring your wool over here to the spinnery and either sell it either sell the wool to them yeah you're gonna have to buy it first look oh, that is um looks like it's a, it's a it's a production plant here 
I don't know what what they make. I think they make clothes. Yeah, I think I think they they are making the clothes here. Um, here. Wool, 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 woolly wool. Where's the wool? Here. Yeah, up to the spinnery, one thousand, one hundred and forty, uh, probably per, um, yeah, per crate. I don't know how that is going to be fared out or measured. Yeah, so this is. I think it's a production plant and a set point in one. Alright. Up to the map here. Um, I like to know. I like to know if we can jump into a train. No, we can't jump into a train. Even though the trains are turned on maybe you, you have to rent a train first and when you have rented a train then you can use it but if you don't rent a train then you wouldn't be able to use it i don't think so biomass energy <clears throat> yeah that is here the south biomass energy plant here biomass you probably can sell your silage here to make a bit of money or even um, I'm thinking this is a uh, no it says here a uh, wood cell point this is a cell point for wood think, um, it's either logs or wood chips I don't know about that I'm gonna have to figure figure that one out um, <clears throat> Once we start the let's play here on the end creek or the Babylon. All right um, Let's have a look at the gas station here That is the garrison's gas station looks pretty awesome to me Nice garrison's gas station here. All right, and you have the the frizzy space extreme. I, don't, <laughs> I just like that sign. Here we have a diner. Little diner. What do we have over here? Looks like the diner is a cell point. Alright. Yeah, the diner. Diner is a cell point because there is a trailer marker there that is a cell point. And and the diner, I think they take cheese. You can sell cheese, and uh, probably you can sell your goods at the diner here. You can uh, fuel up your vehicles at the uh, where they call Garrison's uh, gas station. And you, and you can't, you can't go in. You just uh, can uh, fuel up your vehicles, guys. <coughs> All right. So that's the gas station. What do we have here? The fast food restaurant. Yeah, the fast food restaurant. That is the diner. All right. Um, what do we have here? The feed and grain salt. Feed and grain. Okay, that means um, you can uh, sell your grain here. That is a cell point by the looks of it. Now we're going to have to test all that out before I say something wrong here. What is that? That's some, some type of pipe or something? I don't know. Yeah, we, we're going to have to test all this out. But that looks uh, pretty awesome, guys. Pretty slick. All right. Um, what is that down here? We were already there. Oh, 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 oh diesel locomotive. There's the, the, the train. There it is the diesel locomotive.
Yeah, and you stop here. Since that is a grain storage facility, you're gonna have to stop here with your train and your carts. So you can uh, load up your train carts here with grain, and then you can uh, you can go off with the train and sell your grain as well. That is what what I mentioned earlier. Um, Michael Hammond owns this uh, field here. All right. Um, click on the train here, the diesel locomotive. What is up here? Okay, we, we were there. We were already there. Up here, the red marble bowling restaurant. We were there. Johnson's uh, Farm Market. I think we were we were here as well. Yeah, we were already up here. All right. So we are gonna jump back into the Mahindra here. Let's see where if we can uh, do a little a short one around the map before this video gets uh, too long. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Yeah, we are just going to go up here. What is that sign telling me? Okay, nice one. What do we have here? Okay, that was... What was that? Okay, that was the, the furniture. I think that was the furniture manufacturing plant right there. Okay. All right, we're gonna have him park here. I want to have a look. What the water looks like. Okay, you just uh, moved in there. They are saying that uh, you can uh, drive through water without getting stuck. Let's see. If that's true, Let's see if you can uh, drive through water. Yes, you can. You can uh, drive through water now in Farm Sim 22, <laughs> and we are slipping and sliding all over the place, guys. Yeah, that is what I wanted to test out to see if that's true. If you can uh, drive through water in FS22, and you can. Pretty awesome. Yeah, we are slipping, slipping and sliding, and, and you, you can see that the snow is um, sticking on the tires here, guys. Brilliant. So I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Otherwise, it's gonna get too long, and I am gonna review the Babylon map now. So thanks for watching, guys. Let me know in comments below what you guys think of Farming Sim Later 22. What does that say? License required catch and release single barbless hooks, artificial lures, and flies only. So I will cut the video feed here. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, let me know what you guys think of my Farming Simulator videos. And uh, if you're a farming simulator fan, 
and if you are a farmer let me know what what you guys think of farming simulator 22 and if you like what i do here nice uh, snowmen here i think those snowmen are gone during the summertime i think those those are gonna disappear during the summer so if you like what i do guys subscribe to my channel like my channel comment and watch my videos we have more snowmen here look at that <laughs> all that uh, little detail that they put in in here so yeah thanks for watching guys and we'll see you in the next one bye bye